Wimbledon, Novak Djokovic winning yet another grass court title there at Wimbledon, besting, oh, that bad boy, <laughs> Nick Kyrgios. Lara is back, made her way back across the pond, That's this side name. of the pond. Good morning to you, Lara. Good morning, Robin. Djokovic predicted there would be fireworks, and I can confirm <laughs> being on that court, there definitely were from... All of them, actually, from Kyrgios as he battled Djokovic and himself, frankly, for four nail-biting sets. But in the end, it was the calm, cool Serbian who came out on top, winning his seventh singles title, just one behind Roger Federer for the record. A most unlikely men's vinyl ending up in familiar fashion with top seed Novak Djokovic winning it all again in a four-set nail-biter. The Serbian superstar facing off against red-hot 27-year-old Nick Kyrgios, who was playing in his first Grand Slam tournament final and making quite the impression, showing off his unique moves with a rare underhanded serve, even throwing in a tweener there. Unbelievable. Proving he can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the number one seat on the court and giving the sold-out crowd the full Kyrgios treatment in between points, yelling at his own player's box. Shouting at the ump, asking to have a fan removed for being drunk. The star studded center court filled with fans like Tom Cruise, as well as Prince William, Kate, and their eldest son George, who watched from the royal box. And afterwards, the royals met with Djokovic, who let George hold the trophy. And when it was all over, the two players showing their relationship has come a long way. You and I have a very tough relationship at times, but I, I thought I'd thank you for putting up with it. The 35-year-old seven-time Wimbledon champ even suggesting a new future for the pair. I never thought I'm going to say so many nice things about you, considering, <laughs> considering the relationship. OK, it's officially a bromance. All right. <laughs> Is. It is now a bromance. Djokovic said the pair even had a dinner bet on the match. Winner pays. Unclear, though, when he'll be able to settle that. Does not look like the two will meet at the U.S. Open. Djokovic is unvaccinated, and unless U.S. vaccination policy changes in the next month, he will not be playing at the U.S. Open. And many people are wondering if there will be a change mm -hmm. because he was unable to play the at first the, Grand Slam. Yep, at the Australian. Australian. Did you have a good one. time? Does the voice tell you? <laughs> <laughs> it's fantastic. Good to have you Great back. Great assignment. Good. <laughs> Thanks, Lara. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.